Lutz, thanks for joining me. The unit in front of us looks pretty packed. Tell us what we're looking at here. You're looking at the Sky3 low voltage inverter. Our new inverter concept that helps everyone to build his own motor controller. You know, today motor controller systems that you can buy are typically black boxes, including the power sections, of course, but also the controller and the software, which is pre-configured. So your options, how to modify it, how to adjust it to your system, to your vehicle, are limited. So you have to follow what is given in the inverter. With this new concept, we change the way uh, that is done. We leave the controller and the software, which defines how the system integrates into the vehicle, to the customer. We just provide the power, the housing and the power routing, something that is quite difficult to develop if someone is not a manufacturer of such a kind of product. So with that inverter, everyone who can do a controller and a software can very easily now also do a motor control system. That sounds very interesting, Lutz. Sounds like it might also be interesting for time to market. So if I've understood correctly, basically this means that the customer can bring his own controller board and he writes his own software, but everything else is there. Um, what's the range though of applications from a power perspective that this unit here would cover? It's a huge range of applications you can actually cover because one thing is the application and the other is the power. So the power rating goes up to 55 kilowatts, so you can actually drive quite high powers there. But it also starts to make sense from, for vehicles that have something like eight to nine kilowatts continuous power demand. So there's a huge range. So we start from golf carts, through forklifts, quads, motorbikes, small EVs, up to something that is a smart size or something like that. So the power range is, is huge, the size is small, but whatever you want, it can still fit in there. You can use batteries 24 volts, 48 volts, 80 volts, even up to 144 volts. So whatever is your system concept for low voltage, this will fit in there. So if you write under the, what you see here at the, on the top of the cover, that area is free to be used for the controller. So and it's very easy to put it in. You to basically just take off the lid, put in your controller, screw it, put the lid back on, done. That's all you need to do, no complex mounting process. Sounds exciting. So really, um, anybody that's, that's looking to uh, control a motor everywhere from a golf cart size through to a small passenger car should be potentially talking to us. Obviously though, Semicron is known for its industrial power modules such as Mini Skip, Semi Trans, Semi Pack. Where's the link then to the Sky3 LV? Yes, so we certainly didn't want to reinvent the wheel when we started with the Sky3 low voltage. But of course, there's a different need in that inverter market. The inverter market needs something that is compact, very small, and also to become efficient. So we couldn't just use modules as Semicron builds them today. But what we did is we took the technology that is used in semi tops and uh, mini scapes and all these kind of products Semicron is doing today, and we added the DC link capacitors, the gate driver, the power routing, and all the package all around and formed it into an inverter. But it is from its basic idea just the same as the standard inverter modules Semicron is building today. Sounds good. Thanks Lutz. Thank you.